Sea Transport Logistics, with a successful track record in dust-free transshipment vessels, has focused on a total weather and environmental solution for the 21st century. Traditionally, for bulk transshipment, large storage sheds had to be built on prime waterfront land areas equal to the capacity of an export vessel. Then, large expensive jetties would be built out to deep water. These jetties would also be expensive to remove at the end of the mine life. Most transshipment methods are generally restricted to sheltered inshore or coastal waters, but dust and transportable moisture limits are common problems. Most transshipment methods are normally restricted to a maximum wind speed of 20 to 25 knots, and are also restricted to wave heights of a maximum 2 to 2.5 meters. Most transshipment operations are limited by the size of their feeder vessels and the wind and wave conditions. In a bold change to transshipment thinking, Sea Transport Logistics has focused on small harbor solution with shallow draft feeder vessels. Designed for shallow harbors, we used quad screw stern landing vessels. These vessels can carry a wide range of bulk commodities and are also suitable for containers and rural cargo. Attached to this small harbor is a negative pressure shed that the feeder vessel backs into and is loaded. The feeder has a roller hatch preventing any dust blowing or any rainfall affecting the transportable moisture limit of the cargo being exported. The feeder then proceeds out to a floating harbor transshipper, or FHT. The feeder then goes stern first into the FHT, which is fully covered. The FHT holds 60% of the export vessel's size. So in a cape size operation, the FHT will hold 100,000 tons. The balance of the cargo will be fed during the three to four days allowed for the loadout. Extensive tank testing at the Australian Maritime College showed that the FHT was capable of working in up to five meter external waves in a sheltered, dust-free, enclosed environment. Enclosed handling systems by Sea Transport have accumulated over 32 years' experience. The FHT replaces the need for a large storage shed ashore. The FHT provides a safe dock under cover with no grab spillage or dust or TML problems, and the FHT has backup systems in case of equipment failure. The FHT has ground tackle designed for both vessels and a stern thruster to move out of any beam swell. The FHT can be mobilized using the feeder vessel and a three-axis connection system developed by Sea Transport or alternatively towed. Sea Transport Logistics, Floating Harbor Transship, a compelling operational and environmental solution for the 21st century.